Hello and welcome. I'm glad you are here. Thank you for being a loyal subscriber and allowing me into your home to teach you what I have learned about building a YouTube channel. For new people who do not know me, my name is Rochelle. My brand is the DIY Affiliate and I help people all over the world in different walks of life and different languages to build their online presence the fastest, smartest and most cost effective way possible. This video is the third video in the series that I have started for new beginners on how to build your YouTube channel starting from zero. In this video you will learn the following, uploading your video in YouTube Studio Beta, the title description keywords, creating a video card template, creating end screens using a template, adding to a playlist, creating a new playlist, and this is just the beginning. This is the actual processing of the video and a little bit of search engine optimization. More search engine optimization will be done later. So, without further ado, let's dive right in. Okay, go to YouTube Studio Beta. Click into YouTube Studio Beta because this is where you are going to be doing a lot of your work in. Once you are in YouTube Studio Beta, go to your camcorder and click on create a video or post. Upload video beta. Drag and drop or select a file. We're going to, we are going to drag and drop just going to find my video there it is right there okay so drag and drop drag your video from your desktop and just drop it into this box right here you'll see this arrow going down and that way you know that it has been received. While the video is uploading. So now you will see the title of the video the information that I put in when I set up the channel. Here you can decide to have a custom thumbnail or you can wait and create another thumbnail. So let's just wait. And then next. Add this video to one or more playlists. So either you have a playlist or you are going to create a new playlist. So if you click in creating a new playlist, you can then just add a title. And do you want that playlist visible right now? And my answer is no. I want it private right now. Now, you have to make sure that you click 
create or the playlist will not be created. So you're going to create that. Okay, so now I have two playlists. Add your tags. The tags that are here are the ones that I already have used in my default. How to grow your YouTube, how to start a YouTube channel. But what I want to do is I want to look at other tags for organic traffic. So I'm just going to. This step is very important to do the research for the title before you actually give it a title. And then you see this paper clip here. This will help you copy your tags. And I am doing a tutorial on using the vidIQ, but you should be using vidIQ. If you don't have an account, then go to vidIQ.com and create your free account. I'm just going to copy these. Make sure they are copied to my clipboard. And go back into my my video. And here, so I'm just going to paste these keywords in. Creating an end screen. The end screen is seen in the last 20 seconds of your video. And it usually is a video, a playlist, a subscribe. Okay, so now I have used a template here where I have one subscribe of and best for the viewers. I'm just going to click into use template. You can just click into use template. The templates will come up. And then you decide which one is going to be best for you. A video, a subscribe. Just gonna get do a normal one here. Video, video playlist. Keep going. This is the one that I usually choose. So I have a video or playlist, video or playlist, and here I can choose. And if you just have a couple of videos, you can go with your most recent upload. And best for the viewer. Let's click best for the viewer and then save.
file changes saved. I'm going to go back to my video details. Okay, when you talk about adding a card, first of all, you need to see what and what it does. But what I do is I use templates, and we are going to create a template today. So, welcome back. Well, this is just... the third. Go, and you want to make sure that it is in a place where. You feel that people are going to start, their mind is going to start wandering, so they're going to start losing interest. So you want to put something up. So now when you create a card, you choose a video from your uploads or a playlist, and you can customize your text. So. So you have something called teaser text. It is something that is going to get a person interested in what you are showing them. Create the card. So I'm going to give you an example of all three. Create the card. I have a card created, and then you'll see this circle with the uh, the I in it, which is information. You'll see what I said, learn all my secrets from the DIY affiliate. Okay, next, if you want to create a playlist as well. Just click that and then you can click on playlists. Here I have three videos and I can again customize my text. And then my teaser text would be learn all of my secrets. Learn, not all of my secrets, all learn tips, tricks, and secrets. So I'm going to create the card. Now you can see here that the cards are together, but you can move one card. So so say I move my one card at to start playing at. Three six three fifteen nine, and then I have another card that's going to play at five twelve. So here again, you can see these are your two cards, and these are the times that they are going to be playing at, and these can be changed at any time. So now we are going to choose, say you want to promote another channel. So 
I'm going to create another channel. Channel name or user. Okay, so here is the URL. And the custom message is sharing knowledge is free. And the teaser text is learn DIY affiliate affiliate way. Okay, so I'm just going to create this card. Okay, so now I have these three. In which now I can move this around. Or I can switch places. I can move this down here and then move this one over here. Okay, so next, what you have is a poll. Create a multiple choice poll. So you're going to ask your viewers, what are they interested in? Or how can I help you? So how can I help you? So, how can I help you in, I'm just going to say YouTube, Studio Beta, YouTube, WordPress, or other social media. Okay, and then we're going to create a card. Now, this will help to create engagement. If a person is interested in your channel, then they're they are going to be interested in what you can help them with. What type of value can you add to their life? Okay, now I've got this all done. Now I am going to save it. Okay. And it is going to be called Welcome Back. And I am going to now save it. It will now become a template. So when I click load and it says choose a template, you can see the different templates that I have here. And there is the one for welcome back. So I can use this on other videos and I don't have to reproduce it and do it over. And usually it'll say all changes saved and then return to YouTube Studio. Recording date is today. It's always good to put your recording date because that way people know that your video is up to date and it's new and YouTube will be able to see that as well. So today is the recording date. Allow embed, uh, embedding, yes. OK. 
Okay, and then license Creative Commons, comments and, and ratings. All this has been set up already. So we want to click Next. Okay, so right now it's private before you publish. Okay, so go and I'm just gonna click done. So this is the video processing when you upload the video. This is not the search engine optimization. Just to do a short recap of the first tutorial, we went into your we went into the settings and we set everything up in the general, the channel, the upload defaults, the community and the other settings, as well as the advanced channel settings. We uploaded a video, set the title and the description and the keywords, added it to a playlist, added a couple of video cards, and end screens. This video is now ready to be shared. YouTube, 